Sportsman of North America, your ticket to the outdoors is proudly taking you into extreme hunting excitement and adventures that dreams are made of. If you don't like those traffic lights and those crowded streets, then grab your boat or fishing pole and take a ride with me. We're heading to a place with a lot of space where good old boys can roam. We're leaving behind all the dirt and crime from the cities we call home. Yeah! Mike McKay and Sportsman of North America's founder, Keith Powell, for extreme hunting excitement. Folks, welcome to this week's Sportsman of North America television show. I'm Mike McKay. And I'm Heath Painter. And this week's show, folks, we're going to Southern Colorado Outfitters, hunting with Steve Martinez. And Mike, this guy's got it going on. I guess he does. You guys killed two great goats and... At the end, you take a real good bull. Seven by seven. Yeah. And it, it was a neat hunt because we hunted this elk like you would a whitetail in the Milk River. Yeah, so you kind of intercepted from bedding to feeding. Yeah, that's, that's right. Now, Steve Martinez, he is in a super game-rich area. He has antelope, mule deer, elk, and some whitetail, too. And you took Mikey, Mikey Knobloch with you, didn't you? Pro staffer Mikey Knobloch yep. on his first antelope hunt. That was cool, and he killed a great goat. A 78-inch goat. That's and a great goat. It was pouring down rain. It was nasty. But Mikey was stoked. He got in, got it done. Well, I'll tell you what, the, the goat you took, too, was a, was a good, yeah. heavy, big cutters. Yeah, you know, I was looking for a real tall goat, mm -hmm. and uh, I passed this goat up three times. We nicknamed him Cutters. And on the fourth time I looked at him, I decided to go after him. Well, I'll tell you what, let's get straight to that hunt. We're right out here. Here at Southern Colorado Outfitters, uh, me and my partner, Steve Martinez, we just... Uh, Try to do our best to provide for our clients. We're a family operation. I mean, you come into our camps, we've got our wives, kids running around, sometimes grandkids. We're just a family operation, and we just strive to make the best hunt for somebody and make them feel feel at home. See him right there. Feel comfortable. See right there. What are we doing, man? We got to get over to this point. We're going to be able to get a shot once we get over on this high spot right over here. Should be in good shape. Real good shape. Now, folks. We just spotted a really nice herd of goats. Driving from the road, we glassed them. There's an old homestead up here. What we did is we worked up around on this ridge top. Stay and we're gonna bob and weave, get through some of these cedars, use that as cover to get in close. Give me a range. Old Steve here is gonna, he's gonna close the distance on these goats and hopefully get me within range. Let's do it, man. Can do, let's go. All right, bye. Two twenty six. Two twenty five. Go. Go. There he goes right there. How he's starting to walk away. When he turns back around to the left. Alright, when he gets broadside, I'm gonna hit him. There he is. You ready?
He's down. He's down. Woo, look at that. The old top center. A one-shot drop right there, baby. Woo. Steve, thanks, buddy. Right there he is, too, man. Yeah. Oh, man, I tell you what, if it wasn't for these shooting sticks, I couldn't make it, man. Thank you so much, buddy. All right. Let's go check him out. <laughs> Steve, right there is that speed demon we've been chasing, man. What an awesome goat, man. Look at this bad boy. I re-raged that. 256 yards with the old Thompson Center Pro Hunter, man. That old 270 did its job. Unbelievable. Wow. Look at this buck. Steve, I cannot say enough about your operation, buddy. You know how to put people on game. Man, look at those cutters, deep cutters. You got trash back here. What an awesome goat. And look at that mess. Oh my gosh, man. This is what I came to Colorado for right here, man. Unbelievable. Steve, thank you so much once again, buddy. What an awesome hunt. We got on him up top, slipped through some cedar, and right here he is. A 250 yard shot, 256 yard shot, and the old Thompson Center boy, she barked, didn't she? Put him down. Folks, if you're looking to hunt antelope, mule deer, or elk, Southern Colorado Outfitters will do the job. This man right here will put you on game. This is an awesome hunt, and I can't say enough about this man right here. Woo. Sportsman of North America is proudly brought to you by Matthews Bows, Rivers West, Piston Point Broadheads, Sportsman's Warehouse, Schnee's Boots, Thompson Center Arms, Trijicon, Trophy Taker, E. Arthur Brown Company Incorporated, Doc's Deer Sense, Backstraps, Advantage Max One Camo, Sportsman of North America's Hunting Club, and these other fine sponsors. Sportsman of North America, your ticket to the outdoors, the destination for awesome prizes, cool gear, and outdoor excursion giveaways. And you don't even have to be a member to win. Just go online to sportsmanna.com and register for our grand prize giveaway. It's easy and best of all, free. Just look at these 2006 winning members. Don't miss out. Visit us at sportsmanna.com and register for our grand prize giveaway. Sportsman of North America. Come and join us. Trophy Taker was founded on a single revolutionary archery product, the Trophy Taker Fallaway Arrow Rest. Dan Evans, the inventor of the Trophy Taker, wanted to build the perfect rest for hunting and tournament shooting, and we've done just that. When you need American-made dependability and quality, you have it in a Trophy Taker Arrow Rest. For more on the Trophy Taker and our full line of hunting sites, go to trophytaker.com. Trophy Taker, leading the way on the line and in the field. Well, folks, welcome back to Sportsman of North America television show. Now, Mike, on this next hunt, we're hunting with pro staffer Mikey Knobloch on his first, first hunt. First antelope yep. hunt ever, and he is a nervous wreck. It's almost like he's going up against a brown bear. <laughs> I mean, he got in and got it done, but the weather got nasty. Oh, you had terrible weather, yeah. Pouring down rain. Yeah. The roads were getting sloppy. Mikey had to hit foot a little bit early, but he snuck in and got it done. Let's go to his hunt. Rough enough we can come in on those ridges over mm -hmm. there. 
I tell you what, let's do. Let's drive up on the hill here. They're worried about us right here. Okay, see? Yeah, they don't want us. Let's go up here and to where we can still see them. Wait, Mike, wait. Wait, Mikey. Don't shoot. Shoot him now, Mike. Shoot him. Shoot him. Yeah, he dropped him. Hey! He saw his, saw his buck, Stephen Bryce. We've seen him from a long way off. Got a game plan together, got a good stalk. Came in. Got within, I don't know, a couple hundred yards. We had to do some belly crawling. He was bedded up out here with three or four does. Just so happens, he would, all I could see, all I could see was gear up. Finally got him to stand up, had to do some whistling. And uh, a couple of the does got in the way. I couldn't get a clean shot, had to wait for that. I was thinking they was going to bolt on us, but he walked out from behind that doe and shook off, and there it was. Perfect shot, 270. That encore, man, I love Stick it. Stick around. Sportsman of North America will be right back with more action from Southern it. Colorado Outfitters. Well, folks, you asked for it, and here we are. I'm Keith Powell with Sports of North America, and almost 60% of you voted that you would like to win a Yamaha Grizzly ATV as our next grand prize giveaway. And that's why we're here in Richardson, Texas, at Richardson Motorsports with good friend David Barnett. One lucky person will be holding the keys to this 2008 Yamaha Grizzly ATV. Sportsman of North America, your ticket to the outdoors, the destination for awesome prizes, cool gear, and outdoor excursion giveaways. And you don't even need to be a member to win. Just go to SportsmanNA.com for all the info. Sportsman of North America, your ticket to the outdoors. Folks, don't miss out on this great opportunity. Just go to our website and click on Grand Prize Giveaway and fill out the form. It's that easy, and you could be holding the keys to excitement. Don't miss out. Visit us at SportsmanNA.com. For a store near you, visit sportsmanswarehouse.com. Sportsman's Warehouse, America's premier outfitter. Being able to pull the trigger, well, that's just icing on the cake. But getting there is how the victory is won, one step at a time. Whether it's in the high country, northern tundra, or the southwestern deserts, you better have the boots that'll take you there. I depend on Shanice boots to get me into position, into the lands where the real trophies live. 
Shanice Boots have what it takes for every situation. I'm Heath Painter, and I rely on Shanice for all my footwear needs. Welcome back to Sportsman of North America, your ticket to the outdoors. See that butte over there, Heath? That's where that elk's been bedding. I've seen a lot of game out here in these fields. These boys at Southern Colorado know how to have fun. Heath Painter's gut was sore for days from laughing so hard. These elk on the river bottom, it's basically like hunting a 900 pound whitetail. You get your spots and we try to catch them from the feeding to the bedding grounds, and then the bedding grounds back to the feeding grounds in the evening. It's basically like hunting your whitetail back east. The toughest part of hunting these elk is going to be having patience, sitting and waiting for them to move from their bedding ground to the feeding ground or from the feeding ground to the bedding ground. That's going to be the toughest part, just patient, just waiting. Here's that field I was telling you about, Heath. Let me draw you a map of what the game plan's gonna be. Right here is the river bottom. And then here's a, here's a fence here, and a little field that they're still paying. The milk will be coming out there. There's a tree line here, and that's where we're gonna be. We'll get there tonight in the morning get at this tree line, the milk will feed out across the fence, headed to their bedding ground, and we should catch them right here in this field. That'll be the game plan. It'll work. It'll work. Night or in the morning, we get her done. Mike, I'm into the pools. You sure are. We're getting closer. We got to go to break, but first, I want you to share with the viewers what Sportsman of North America is. You know what Sportsman of North America is. I know is. what it is. Folks, it's going to be the biggest, it's the best by far club in the entire country. Opportunities that, that until now, is unheard of. Right. We give away a free hunt every single week. That's 52, 52 hunts a year. And to boot, at the end of it, we'll give a free grand prize giveaway, which this year is a, a grizzly, a Yamaha grizzly four-wheeler. Yeah, last year, we gave away a fishing trip, a peacock bass fishing oh, trip. unbelievable Brian trip. Brian Sullivan, he won had it. The, had the trip of his trip lifetime. Trip of a lifetime, and he wasn't even a member. But being a member is so much more benefits. Oh, yeah, there's, there's a lot more benefits. As a member, if you book a hunt, if you're not a, a lucky winner, and if you book a hunt, you're entitled, if you're a bronze, silver, or gold member, you're entitled to additional discounts off of those hunts. You save money. Not just that. You can't buy the hunt from the outfitter. Cheaper. Cheaper than you can buy it from Sportsman of North America That's right. as a member. And we pre-qualify those outfitters, so you're going Absolutely. with the best. Yeah, yeah. You're going with good quality outfitters. Absolutely. Mike, when we get back, I'm going to get in. I'm going to get tight with that bull. <laughs> so, folks, we'll be right back for some more action right here on Sportsman of North America. Sportsman of North America, your ticket to the outdoors, the destination for awesome prizes, cool gear, and outdoor excursion giveaways. And you don't even have to be a member to win. Just go online to sportsmanna.com and register for our grand prize giveaway. It's easy and best of all, free. Just look at these 2006 winning members. Don't miss out. Visit us at sportsmanna.com and register for our grand prize giveaway. Sportsman of North America. Come and join us. For a 
store near you, visit sportsmanswarehouse.com. Sportsman's Warehouse, America's premier outfitter. Being able to pull the trigger, well, that's just icing on the cake. But getting there is how the victory is won, one step at a time. Whether it's in the high country, northern tundra, or the southwestern deserts, you better have the boots that'll take you there. I depend on Shanice Boots to get me into position, into the lands where the real trophies live. Shanice Boots have what it takes for every situation. I'm Heath Painter, and I rely on Shanice for all my footwear needs. Welcome back to Sportsman of North America, your ticket to the outdoors. Folks, welcome back to the show. I'll tell you what, Jimmy has got you right amongst them, Dunny. I'll tell you what, he's done his homework. He's practically lived with these elk all summer. He's filmed them. He's glassed them. He knows what bulls are in there. And you know what? That is exactly what I'm talking about. When we talk about pre-qualified outfitters. They've done their homework. They've done their homework. And you know, there's a lot of people out there that have the conception that a guided hunt is a piece of cake. It's, it's still an a easy. Hunt. It's a hunt. It, but, it's a hunt. But here's the thing. Here's the thing. You actually end up hunting from day one. Absolutely. You're not scouting for a week. Right. Before you start the hunt. Right. Exactly. And, and by the time you find the animals, most of the time you got to go home. Right. And you've done them, and I've done them. I've done the self-guided hunts, and I'm not saying they're not a lot of fun. They are a lot of fun. But you've got to have a lot of time. You need the time. I mean, I'd done five self-guided hunts in Alaska. The last trip I did in Alaska was 24 days. Oof. They flew me in and dropped me off, and we was there for 24 days. Now, I'll tell you what. We got it done. I killed a great big bull moose, and I got a great caribou. But I had the time to do it, and that's what it takes. Right. And if you don't have the time, if you can't take three weeks to go on a hunt, or even two weeks. A lot of people can't take two weeks to go on a hunt. Right. When you go on that hunt, you better be into the animals right away. Otherwise, you're going to waste most of your time locating. Well, I tell you what, Jimmy's definitely located the bulls. He They're in there did. screaming. Let's, let's get, get back. straight to it. Let's get back to the hunt. Before the break, show host Heath Painter was getting into position with a huge 7x7 seven seven bull closing in. Let's join back in on his hunt. Southern Colorado Outfitters, me and Steve, we've been raised here all our life. We've hunted it since we can hunt, and it's where we were raised, and we know the terrain, we know the game, we know where to find the big bulls, the big elk, big deer, antelope, whatever you want to hunt, from mountain lion to elk, we can find it. Yeah. Oh, man. Oh, yeah, baby. Man. Oh, man, what a monster. What a monster. He's down right there. Jimmy, man. All right. There was elk right there. Man. Get it. Whew. What a giant bull. Man, did you see him screaming out there on that edge? Oh, my gosh. The old Thompson Center. 300 wind mag, man. Uh, I know it, man. That muzzle break. E. Arthur Brown accurized that barrel. That was a 350 yard shot right there, man. Unbelievable. Yeah. Oh, let these bulls get out here. Let these elk get out here. We'll go look at them. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, Jimmy. Man, I cannot say. Cannot explain what I'm feeling right now, man. What a giant bull. That's a long ways, man. That is a long way. Oh my gosh, buddy. Yeah. 
What a dandy. My knees are still shaking. <laughs> That's awesome, buddy. Woo! My gosh, what a bull. What a bull. Oh my gosh, man. Put the old Thompson Center down. Shooting sticks. Jimmy. Holy smokes, man. Seven by seven. Seven by seven, baby. Man, let me get a hold of this bad boy. Holy smokes. That is a monster. River bottom elk. Who would ever thought, man? Hunting these bad boys just like we hunt whitetails. It's kind of like hunting Milk River. Out here, this river bottom is just loaded, not only full of elk, but full, full of muleys and a few little whitetails. But man, right there, what a dandy. Look at him. Look at the mass on him right there. 32. Unbelievable. A seven by seven. Congratulations. Man, I appreciate it. Jimmy, I cannot say enough about your operation, yours and Steve's operation. Southern Colorado Outfitters, man. Not only have you put me on this monster elk, but last week we shot two trophy antelope. And then another one of my pro staff guys, Chris Halsey, shot a nice mule deer with you guys with a muzzle loader. But look at this bad boy right here, man. Awesome, man. And he's huge. That first shot hit him right in the shoulder. Tag on. I just don't know what to say. <laughs> Unbelievable. Thank you, man. Heath, congratulations. Buddy. Thanks, man. Good I, bull. Oh, Good boy. Bull. I tell you what, that, that was exciting. You know, they were coming in, screaming, Lots cows of action. running. Oh, yeah. Anytime you can hunt like that, I mean, I love the whitetail hunt. Yep. When you hunt over a food source. Same scenario. Oh, boy. Unbelievable. Jimmy and Steve Martinez, they put me on the Absolutely. Animals. Once again, folks, pre qualified outfitters, good quality outfitters. Yep. Folks, if you like what you just watched, Mike, we got a special going on this week. We sure we, do. We have a two and a half hour hunting DVD from North America. And I tell you what, we just finished it up. It's a great DVD, but tell them about it. Okay, the first 100 people that call the number on your screen right now will receive a free DVD. Right, all they have to do is pay shipping and handling $2.95 right. for a two and a half hour hunting DVD. It's gonna wrap it up for this week. That's right, man. Folks, I'm Heath Painter. And I'm Mike McCabe, and we're wishing you all the best here at Sportsman of North America. Thanks for watching Sportsman of North America's TV show, where we are your ticket to the outdoors. If you like what you watched and would like to find out more about who we are and more about our fine sponsors, go to our website, sportsmanna.com. And if you're looking for a connection to the outdoors for hunting and other outdoor excursions, we're your ticket for that as well. Plan your next trip with us. Once again, thanks for watching, and we'll see you next week right here on Sportsman of North America. This has been a Sportsman video production in association with Heat Painters Wild Eyes Production, bringing the outdoors home.